Britain cannot lawfully leave the customs union with the EU and the Irish backstop will last indefinitely under Theresa May's withdrawal agreement, the full legal advice on Brexit reveals. The full and final advice given to the Cabinet by Attorney General Geoffrey Cox was made public today after MPs found the government to be in contempt of Parliament for not already publishing it. The Prime Minister fought back at PMQs, a day after crashing defeats in the Commons over Brexit saying the government had not concealed the facts on Britain leaving the EU. Pages of the legal advice were posted to Twitter by several MPs, including Caroline Lucas and shadow Brexit Secretary Sir Keir Starmer, before it was published. It sets out that in its current drafting, May's Brexit deal does not provide a mechanism that is likely to enable the UK lawfully to exit the UK-wide customs union without a subsequent agreement. It adds, this remains the case even if parties are still negotiating many years later. Another section states that despite statements the Irish backstop is not intended to be permanent and the clear intention of the parties that it should be replaced by alternative, permanent arrangements, the legal advice warns that in law, the backstop would endure indefinitely until a superseding agreement took its place. It also set out that goods passing from Great Britain to Northern Ireland will be subject to a declaration process, Regulatory checks would have to take place between Northern Ireland and Great Britain, normally at airports or ports and that Great Britain will no longer be a member of the EU's single market for goods or the EU's customs arrangements. This means any British goods crossing the border into the EU will be subject to third country checks by member state authorities to ensure those goods meet EU standards. Labour MP Mr Starmer said that the 33-paragraph document revealed the central weaknesses in the government's deal. Theresa May is said to be heading for an almost certain defeat when MPs come to vote on her deal because of the Irish backstop that could keep the UK tied to EU customs rules in the event no deal can be agreed. The Irish backstop or safety net, refers to the potential of a hard border between Northern Ireland and the Republic of Ireland. The UK as a whole and the Republic of Ireland have all made it clear they do not want a hard border, while the EU agreed to the principle of avoiding it in December 2017. So the backstop is in place to ensure that, even if an appropriate deal cannot be made between the UK and the EU, also known as a no-deal scenario, a hard border won't be put in place, despite it being a land border between the UK and the EU. The safety net of no-deal is that Northern Ireland and the rest of the UK will enter a temporary customs union allowing the continued soft border with Ireland. The main issue is that the EU only wanted the temporary customs union to include Northern Ireland while Theresa May says it must include the whole UK. Geoffrey Cox's legal advice outlines that the Irish backstop deal does not allow Britain to leave the UK-wide customs union without further agreement. It also sets out that the Irish backstop would in law endure indefinitely despite government saying it will be temporary.